I need you right now When no one else was around, I need you right now I need you right now I'm so grateful I never realized all my favor Cause I just wanted to be famous I know that life is so dangerous, yeah But I'ma glorify his name so you know I had to Had to put a little swag on it, Oh, You deserve the most swag on it Had to go real hard for it They don't understand I'm covered in this blood Had to tell you I'm covered in this love I got protection from above, yeah oh, 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 oh. I got people trying to bring me down But my lifeline is for a lifetime, yeah I got protection from all around Angels around me, yeah, they hold it down Hey guys, we're going to be doing something a little different today You see, I am somewhat dressed for work The hair is like not done slicking down yet Not done, not done, I have my little scarf on But we are doing a chit chat, get ready with me for work And I wanted to show you guys what I kind of do when it comes to crunch time So let's get started, let's not delay So I have my Lancome Hydra Base Hydra Glow La Base Pro Hydra Glow whatever like it's halfway in French and as you can see I've worn this little baby down to the ground <laughs> I'm almost out and let's just say mama cannot afford another so I have a little bit on my thumb here and we're gonna rub it in it feels so good going on I've already um moisturized my face after I've washed um that is a super important step that a lot of people miss so I just want to tell you that that is so important. You must do that. You must, 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 dush, must do. So this is part of my get ready for work routine. I kind of speed through because I usually um, don't have very much time when it comes to makeup. And I usually end up leaving my house pretty, pretty late what you guys see me use pretty often this is and it was upside down my sheer wisdom serum shadow this is an eye primer by butter london it's one of the best things that you can use for your eye it's very hydrating especially if you have more mature skin kind of like i do this helps for oily lids dry lids and what it does is it makes sure that it target the lid area and make sure that your shadow goes on nice and smooth it doesn't break up or oxidize throughout the day so your shadow stays in place how awesome is that with my crayon case brow pomade and um i kind of need my brow brush first because i don't believe in doing anything without my brow brush it's attached to my goof proof brow pencil which i probably should start learning how to like keep lids available but i'm kind of sucky at that kind of sort of so i just kind of brush up and remember this is like for work so i don't get all elaborate or anything i just try to make sure that they're at least distant cousins or related you know so i start off by doing the little little thing right there I like how this pomade kind of goes in nice and easy try to make sure that you know it's nice and close and then I give the little underneath right and then since this brow already has a nice fill in I don't have to do much more but just close off the back do you see that right there this brow isn't as lucky though so you have to do just a little bit more work on that brow a little bit more work on this brow here not too much more but just a little bit extra what i'm gonna do so since i probably can just do one two marks strokes right there i need to fill in here hopefully you guys can see just like that swivel it around and i'm shaky because i haven't even eaten yet <gasps> bad v bad v that's okay though. I'm gonna stop and get a sausage McGriddle. And then we are done. <clears throat> we are done, done, done. Well, almost done-ish. Done-ish. Is that even a word? So anyway, I try to make sure that like um I look somewhat presentable. I don't try to like go all out and do like this fabulous glam. I don't have a glamorous job and I don't have to be like super fabulous at my work so they don't get to see that side of me.
nonprofit agency and our nonprofit. Oh, I should have told you what I was doing again, huh? So I have a little bit of concealer on my brush here, and I'm just going to clean up to make them look, you know, all natural. Well, not super all natural, but you know, you get the gist. This is about as glam as the brows get for work. Pretty much. Anyway, so our nonprofit represents uh, victims of domestic violence. And um, one of the things that we specialize in is for women who need to start over. So they need to learn a new trade. So we provide job training. Um, we also assist in community service for, you know, the teenagers that have gone a little bit of astray and they need some guidance. We also help you learn a new skill. So if you want to open your own business, uh, learning to do what we do, which is uh, buy clothing at wholesale and we turn around and resell it for much, much, much cheaper. <clears throat> That's kind of what we do, you know, and we give back into our community. We work with local welfare agencies, stuff like that. So, you know, if you get um, assistance, you can come on in and see if you can get a contract with us and your worker and you can do like that little welfare to work program. It's like that. So we try to give back and we try to make sure that you learn a little bit along the way. It's going to be nothing special. We're going to use this BH Cosmetics Neutrals Palette because, you know, it's the office. We don't want to be like, Miss is, you know, still your husband with our sexy eyes. No, I'm kidding. We don't do any of that. So we're going to go ahead and start with our flesh base color here because again, it is the office and we want to just be a little bit on the softer side of life. <laughs> so anyway, um, my job is a blessing to a lot of people. We've helped change some lives. We've had some people come in and not be you know, so transformed by it, but that's okay. That is like the nature of the beast. And sometimes when you're dealing with um, the public and, you know, general like that, you don't always end up with the best results, but it happens, you know. Not every story is going to be a success story, but we've had some success stories and that's what it's all about, you know. We have a clothing closet. We have an interview closet. We even have some stuff for the kids, because at the end of the day, if we can help transform the mamas, we can also help transform the kiddos. And that's what it's all about. You got to give back and make sure the kiddos is happy too. Chocolate color up here and I'm going to blend this in. Anywho, back to the job. So like I was saying, we have had some success stories. We've had some not so success stories. But that kind of comes with the territory. So part of my job is I take the pictures and I also go out and try to find donations. I'm kind of like the photographer and the human, is it human resources? I don't think it's human resources. Charity person-ish? Look, whatever. I'm kind of like the whatever you need, I got it. Whatever you want, I got it. Type deal. I'll leave all the deets in the description boxes. It's just, you know, whatever. Anyways. So, you know, it's a really great job. It's a blessed opportunity. I can say that it's a really, really, really blessed opportunity. And it's a blessing to be a part of something so grand and awesome. I really feel as if um, every place, every place should have something like that. So now I've got some purple-ish type of glitter to kind of give it just a little pop. Just a little bit. Not much. Not much. Because again, it is the office. We don't want to wow them. Well, just a little bit. We want enough to be presentable. Just be presentable. And plus, you know, who doesn't like a little bit of stuff-ish like that? So we're just about done with the eyes. I know you guys are thinking like, this look is crazy. It's not crazy. I promise you it's not. It's not that crazy. Life by Alcone Perfect Mascara, which is also super perfecto for the office. This wand, if you, you know, you can judge a good mascara by the wand. The wand is El Perfecto. El Perfecto. So one thing that's really good is you can do this little shimmy move. Shimmy, shimmy, y'all. Bam. And it gives it a lot of extra volume, a lot of extra length. Anywho, 
my coworkers are insane. I love them to pieces, though. I think I have, like, the best coworkers in creation. They're just a little what I like to call politically obsessed. Doesn't bother me. Actually, it kind of makes me laugh and gives me something to pray about. Um, I usually often sit a little quiet while they're debating or uh, yelling about politics. And I'm just like, you guys are nuts. <laughs> You guys are nuts. But at the end of the day, they have the biggest hearts that you can ever see on people. Um, I'm, I feel like sometimes in life, you end up at a place where you're supposed to be. And even though at times it becomes a little bit uncomfortable, it is definitely where you're supposed to be. Because you realize where else could you be? You end up realizing that you never really could be anywhere else. What I like to call at the home stretch. See how fast time is going by. And this is what you can do when you're running low on time. You just do like a quick little neutral look to complement your skin tone and your face. And then bam, you do your mascara and then bam, you get to your eyeliner. Bam, bam. Look at this felt tip. Uh, it's just heavenly. It goes on so fast. Check this out. And I get a little quiet because I'm in like concentration. See that? Perfect execution. <gasps> Perfect. I suppose it would be even more perfect if I actually eat breakfast and I don't shake. But even with an unsteady hand, this came out um, perfection. That's probably why it's called the perfect eyeliner pen, right? That might be why. And I'm just going to tune up where I kind of messed up with my little shaky hand here. Um, I need to eat breakfast. Um, yeah. Oh, good V. Tell me, do you guys kind of skip breakfast in the morning and end up like a little nervous wreck? Because you do? Or are you like not V and R smart and then we'll go ahead and have breakfast. Our foundation. This is Danessa Myrick's perfect foundation for Lime Life by Alcone. And we're going to go ahead with our primer mist. This is a fast application, which is why I use it for work. So we spray our little beauty blender. Bow. Blah out. You don't have to do this. I just enjoy a dewy look. Um, I have oily skin and you may think, well, you already have a dewy look since you have oily skin. No, correction, it doesn't work like that. That's called oil, not do. So this kind of just goes on like this, like this. I like this especially because it is a wax base. I don't have to use a lot to get the job done. And I don't have to use a lot of concealer after. I believe it's full coverage. I'm not 100% sure. Um, this is one of the ones, I have another one, which is Lime Life's regular, not by Danessa Myricks, it's just theirs. <clears throat> I believe that one's full coverage. I'm not too sure. But I don't have to go through like a lot of concealing steps after like some of my other ones, you know? I don't have to do all that. So we just dab, 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 and then we blend like a crazy person for like 45 seconds. More steps to go. So we're gonna start off with these last steps with the Cake Face Concealer in Your Beautiful by Beauty Bakery. I love Beauty Bakery. Oh, it doesn't smell good though. I wish it did. So we're going to do, based on my little my little video I did last time with how to make sure you know, you're not showing all your little impurities. Um, I'm not all about perfection, but I am just a little bit about, you know, honey, can you put your bag away? So when you're doing a little work-ish look, nothing is ever going to be perfect. And I'm not about perfection, but like I said, just, you know, honey, can you put your bag away? Can you put your bag away? And when I do stuff like this, people at work swear I have like the best skin in them all. No, I just got good skincare products and I just got great makeup. And it doesn't budge like um, between the Lime Life that I use 
and the Beauty Bakery. It doesn't budge. I noticed those two makeups. Is that a word? Makeups? Between those two and Tarte, those are the two that don't go anywhere like all day long. And I lied. There is another step because we kind of need to do setting powders, right? Kind of need to do setting powder before we do it. Hickory setting flower in translucent. Eh, this stuff is LaBomb.com. It's just a little messy ass yassy. And I only use a stippling brush. I don't use the big full, full thingy brush because I don't need it. And I seem to move just a tad bit faster when I use a stipple brush. Um, it doesn't get all over the place and I don't need it everywhere. Just in the spots where I had the concealer. Which is just in here. Because the setting powder would take care of the rest. And yes, this is like exactly how fast I move in the morning when I notice. Ah! I have about like eight more minutes to move. Uh, anyway, back to my wonderful job. My job's great. Why don't you tell me about your job down in the comments? Because I bet you guys probably have better jobs than I do. Because you know what? Any job is a good job, especially because, you know, you get paid and some jobs have benefits. You know, that's probably not a good thing to say because not every job is a good job. Some jobs you probably want to take your boss and smack them upside the head. So now we got our lips. This is sheer lipstick number 200 from Lime Life by Alcone. I don't know what color it is, but it's neutral and it rocks. It goes with our eyes. <laughs> Um, you don't always have to match your eyes, but I try to. I try. I try. I try. I try. Finish look. We are hair did. We are makeup did. We are lips did. We are nice and neutral for the office and we didn't even spend a whole heck of a lot of time doing so. Let me know down in the comments what type of job you have. Do you like your job? Do you hate your job? Do you love your co-workers? Do you wish you were doing more with life? Do you hate this video? Do you love this video? Whatever the case may be. I love taking out with you guys and I hope you guys love taking out with me. I also hope that you like, subscribe, and share and if you haven't already go ahead and like hit that little bell wait like subscribe and share but when you do that like when you subscribe you have to hit the bell and then you have to hit it again to make the little parentheses thing anyways we're running out of time right because i have to get to work anyways i hope you guys love the video i love you guys stay gold stay wonderful find a way to be good to someone today because it costs nothing to be wonderful to people I love you guys. Have a great one. See you soon. Bye.